you said they need to sell, th that you need to buy through the sales funnel. Yes. I need you to clarify that. You don't want to see the customer any other way than going through your sales funnel. Just elaborate on that a little bit. That's a call that I make because I don't want, it's hard for me to measure something when it's not set in stone. You know what I mean? <laughs> and so I, I'm actually eventually trying to build something, especially in the sales process where I'm not that involved, but I'll be very involved for the first little while. So it's hard for them to do that when I'm allowed, when I'm letting people come in however they want. So you're just qualifying your buyers then basically. You're qualifying um, them to make sure that they're the right candidates you want to work with. Make sure that you know, you're, they're all qualifiers as you're going down through your you process. Lean in the qualifiers as you're moving down through the process. <laughs> yeah, the issue is also that like, if I keep letting people come in however they want to, like, it means my funnel didn't do its job. You know what I mean? That's what I look at. This, the funnel is not me. So if people keep asking me and DMing me all these questions, it means something in the funnel isn't working right, and that's what I take it as. So I take all those questions that they're asking, and then we go make adjustments to the funnel because the funnel didn't do its job.